Our Honourable Prime Minister has come to our control centre today to congratulate each one of us and we were excited to hear his wonderful speech and words of congratulations to us and he was actually emotional to uh, about this uh, historic event of India being in being the very first nation to have our Tiranga on moon and uh, all of us very happy to know the naming of those two sites the Chandrayaan 2 landing site which is now going to be called Tiranga and Chandrayaan 3 landing site which is now going to be known as the Shiva Shakti point and not only that he has also outlined what is vision for the generation of youngsters in this country to take up science, technology, engineering for making India a technology powerful nation in the future. We require a leader like this. He has given a vision. See, as far as talent is concerned, ISRO is not having any shortage of talent. What is required basically is a leader who can inspire. And the current Prime Minister, he has been doing it, he is giving us a good guidance there. And I am sure under his leadership, country will do wonders. What he is telling is, like for example, in, if, if you go in our Hindu mythology, there is something called Hanumana. Hanuman knew everything, but somebody has to come and remind. So here also what happened, he has basically given a reminder, you are talented, you are knowledgeable. Don't worry, go ahead, I am there with you. I am going to inspire you. And basically just, you know, out of the box thinking he has been telling. He said, you know, for example, Chandrayaan Chandri 2. Afterward, people would have got disappointed. I mean, because of failure. But he says, no, from the failure, you learn about the success. Now we have come to Chandrayaan 3. And like this, you know, there are various missions are there. For example, we have got Aditya. who will be going and, I mean, doing a victory over the sun. The next comes a Venus and so many things are there. So there again, he says that, you know, it's all basically you are talented. Do the hard work. And the total, I mean, 140 crores population, the country is with you. Prime Minister is with you. I mean, that's what the message is given to the scientist community. Manny Pradhan Mantri Ji ne, some is roke vaikyani ko ko, aaj urja se bhar diya. So whatever he has done till today, so really thankful to our honorable Prime Minister. The wonderful and he has pointed out that is a Shiva Shakti point on the whatever he landed the point. So he has emphasized that. So he has encouraged all of our Ishno scientists. So thank you so much, thank you so much for the Prime Minister of India, long life Prime Minister. So emotional, so heart touching and we all become really emotional by speaking. We never thought of giving this kind of speech and we have, he has blamed so many things. It is a historical day for this road. He has taken us to a new world by telling the kind of responsibility what we have on ISRO and he has exemplarily told about the applications in space, uh, space applications. On behalf of the FBI, the PM has arrived in Strack Bangalore to announce uh, the general success and also he has announced that we are happy that he has announced that we have to land at Atlantic, Shiv Shakti and also he announced the day is Space Day. India has made history by landing on the south pole of the moon and Prime Minister of India, P.M. Modi, has come and greeted us and he has inspired their uh, scientists behind his hand and he has inspired the entire nation and all the children of India to take up such challenging job for the future and uh, for the benefit of the common man.